go. One more, Tyler. So my little furry buddy. Is that a bat? That's mm -hmm. a little bigger furry. <laughs> This morning it's almost five minutes to eight Tuesday the 22nd of August and uh, we're gonna be taking out this old wilter beast this is a molar climate troll I like the color blue with a little bit of bluish green this is from the 60s she's an old one so yeah we're gonna be basically replacing all this uh, we're putting in an 80 percent, 80 percent Armstrong, and new water heater was already in. We're gonna be dropping a liner down and uh, redoing all this. Uh, electrician should be here sometime and replacing this uh, old Pushmatic, beautiful breaker box. It's old. Um, we're going to be adding an AAC. Morning, Tyler. Morning. Um, we're going to be going probably through here and then out. So we got to kind of maneuver around all this stuff. Yeah, we're jamming right along. Well, 20 after 8, same day. We're uh, getting this big old Wilter Beast tore apart. This thing is just massive. This is actually a smaller one. We've seen them a lot bigger, haven't we, Corey? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yep, gotta take them all apart, huff them up the stairs, and have their scrap guy come pick them up, because I'm not messing with it. Right, Tyler? Right. These old vulture beasts, man, you gotta take them all apart. Just imagine back in the 60s, they used to come these, these, these panels all used to be all apart. And bring all these things down and then put them all together. And this thing here was the very first thing that they brought in was this freaking heat exchanger. This thing is just like a size of a Volkswagen. Ooh, got a little, we got a little, hey, how you doing little furry buddy? You got a little Mises down here. All right, coming together, look at that fishing. It's like a water fountain right there. All right, there's very inefficient burners. <laughs> About a 60% efficient if we're lucky. All right, get this thing finished torn apart and call the scrap guy. Is that better? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> other side don't we let me see if I can get oh my goodness oh. Oh, this one's a little involved isn't it 
to do this. I probably should throw the bigger one in my trailer. You're just not, you know what I mean? Wrenching those old bolts off. What is it? I told Tyler it's going to be breaking free in a second. Yep. So pressure back to you slightly, Tyler. Yep. That right out by my truck. Make it. <clears throat> Belly of the beast. Belly of the beast. Yeah, that's just a, a little light guy versus some of the ones we've taken out over the years. <laughs> I've actually taken out one that's about the three times size of that, and it's just uh, solid. That's no fun. That's a young man's sport, right, Tyler? Yeah. Not an old man sport no more. <coughs> Get a measurement on the chimney. Got a liner. And gutters are nice and full. Oh. Ouch. That was my knee. Oh, my knee just popped. Oh, we have an offset. We have an offset. Hello down there. Hey, you ready? No, not yet. Just getting measurements. Eight and a quarter. Eight and a quarter. That did not feel good on my knee. <clears throat> so this is a uh, 16 center of sad is eight. cut this up and fold it. Grab a hold of it. Ready? Okay, that should be good. 
Now there is an offset up there, so I'm hoping uh, we don't get jammed up. So I'm gonna need you, when I get in a second, I'll need you to go downstairs and catch. But I gotta grab a drill. Actually, run down and grab me the drill, man. Where is it down here? Yep. wasn't expecting that. You pushing that. Oh yeah. Going past that. All set. this to get a good seal. Okay. Pull it tight. Pull it tight. There it is, folks. All right, so about 20 after 10. Finally got the water heater vent done. I still got to put a strap on it. Uh, Corey's outside with Tyler. He's teaching Tyler how to do the way he does metal. Um, they're, they're working on that. I'm going to get ready to uh, probably move this stuff out. But I'm going to probably do the pilot hole and get that drilled out for the line set. It's coming together. It's coming together. Anybody use these before? These, uh, I just got these, so uh, end of last year. I love them. Pretty much go through anything. So we're gonna go two and a half. Leave it in the comment section below if you uh, if you use these or if you've never seen them before. We're in Lake Flynn. Now pull this line set. Let me put my Air X uh, Titan cover on first. See the 
here's the hole. This thing will slide right up and cover everything and that'll be drawn tight and I'll see that hole right up. Yeah, it's nothing gourmet, but I figure I'd buy the lunch. Gotta have the jalapenos. Is done. That was a tricky one. There was no flat sides, and the Spin Monster made it happen. Wow! It definitely takes some uh, know-how to do that. All right, there we go. We got it finally done, and it's uh, about five minutes to four. Still the twenty-second. Uh, guys did a great job jamming this out. Corey's metal turned out freaking awesome. Tape job looks fantastic. Uh, so yeah, got the liner down, got the double wall B vent. This is a uh, Selkirk. This is uh, made I think right in Grand Rapids, Grand Rapids, Michigan. Some people are saying it's dryer vent. It's not dryer vent. It's double wall b vent it's listed you all listed use this for quite a while so new uh vent for the water heater strapped up line sets done and uh yeah tyler did a good job in the gas pipe electrics all dialed in and this thing is just uh a lot smaller than that old Wilter Beach, and you can see right where it came to right there. So, saving them some room. Let me go outside and show you the AC. Yeah, I had to dig the china right here just to try to make sure the ground grounds level. You can see <laughs> it looks nice. Good. I'm waiting on the electrician to. He's going to be changing that service out uh, from that Pushmatic, but probably a Square D, uh, 200 amp. So he'll be running a new uh, disconnect and probably a GFI out here for us. If you got any value out of this content, smash that thumbs up button. If you're not subscribed, consider subscribing. It really helps the channel grow. If you uh, see anything in this job that needs to be tweaked, uh, leave it in the comment section below. See you in the next one.